I'll be talking about the in possession from the perspective of the outside fullbacks. So if our right center back here has the ball, um, this right outside back or near side wants to provide immediate support and coverage to that player, as well as provide an option or an outlet pass to this center back. Um, whereas our far side left or left fullback, we want this person to get high and wide up the field. This creates obviously a lot of space in this area, as well as um, the opponent on the other team will have to make the decision. Do I drop into this space or do I um, mark this center back area? So obviously as our center back, we want to look forward. We want to go forward if we can at all costs. But if we cannot, we want to just keep the ball and obviously progress through our third. So we can progress through our defensive third up into our um, middle third and lastly to our attacking third where we hopefully can create um, a quality um, goal scoring opportunity. So let's say our center back finds our defensive mid midfielder um, who could either find our forward, who could either find our attacking midfielder, who could then, one of these players could either play a ball through of our right outside back who is getting involved into this attack and providing width and numbers um, for our team. So once, um, if this player is making this attack or making this run and finds this ball through here, this person is most likely going to be in, on a one-on-one -on -one situation with an, out, uh, an outside back from the other team, or they could combine with, let's say, our forward is either making a run or this forward or our attacking mid is making that run. We could either find like a one um, wall pass, or this person could um, obviously take this player on, get on line, and serve a ball across, or could obviously serve a ball over here depending on the position of that defender on the other team. Whereas on this outside, on the other side, this person could obviously creep into this space too and provide another option into our box and provide more numbers into the box. However, this is going to really depend on, I guess, our possession of the ball as well as the, the positioning of the other team. So if we also, because we really want to make sure we are numbers up here in the back. If we are not numbers up in the back, we don't want to have to send this forward, forward because that could be obviously a very dangerous situation for us. And so um, the outside backs have a very important role in providing width, width for our team and being an option into our attack, as well as they have very many defensive duties as well in providing support and coverage and overall maintaining our shape and staying connected with the entire team.